assalamu alaikum and hello all my dear viewers welcome back to my channel today i'm going to share with you mouth melting very delicious sweet shop style barfi recipe without mawa and without condensed milk so let's get started for this first of all heat a kadai on the stove and add in approximately 500 ml or 2 cups of milk stir it continuously and cook until it reduces half and only 1/3 of the quantity is left now take a grinding jar and add in 1 cup of chopped fresh coconut into it i have peeled the hard part of the coconut as you can see and i have chopped it roughly now add it into the grinding jar and grind it without adding any water or milk as smooth as possible so here you can see i have grinded it well and here the milk is also reduced so you can see it has become half than its quantity and now i'm going to add in 1/4 cup of sugar into it you can adjust the sweetness accordingly and now give it a good mix and cook until the sugar completely dissolves in the milk this step of reducing the milk will give the same taste of that of the mawa now add in the grinded mixture so do follow this and uh, do reduce the milk first before adding in the coconut mixture and now continuously give it a mix and make it lump free continuously stir it and do take care to keep the flame to the lowest now continuously go on mixing otherwise uh, it will stick to the bottom and will start to burn so continuously stir it and after stirring it for continuously 5 to 6 minutes add in 1/4 teaspoon of cardamom powder and give it a good mix in case you like any other flavor you can use essence of any other flavor that you like so now you can see it is just perfect Now turn the stove off and we are going to pour in the mixture into the greased tray. I have added in the butter paper and I have greased it with some ghee. Now flatten it using spatula and top it accordingly. I am going to garnish it with a few chopped pistachios and a few rose petals for a good look. And now allow it to set for one to two hours. So here you can see I have settled it in the fridge, so that I want to show you the earliest. You can even store it on the kitchen counter for about two to three hours. Now I'm going to cut it in my desired way. You can cut it in your desired way. And this mouth melting, very delicious, without condensed milk, without milk powder, and without mawa or the koya. The very delicious mouth melting barfi is ready. Trust me, whenever any guest is going to come, do make this and give them. They will very much be surprised to have this and will praise you a lot. So this was my recipe for today. If you like it, do like, share, and subscribe for more such amazing recipes. Bye.